Chrissy Crew, we at the home stretch. We are at the home stretch, y'all. Ooh, I haven't really ate nothing all day. This particular, I just got this off my porch. Um, This had to be shipped, actually, separately. Now, that's the drawback, too. Some of this stuff has to be shipped instead of just delivered. So, you might have to wait a day or two or even longer than that sometimes. That's the only thing. I'm just tossing them over to the side. I think we got some refrigerator stuff. Butter. I use real butter. I uh, Usually, I get one salted and one unsalted. Because some recipes call for salted. And some call actually for unsalted. I usually don't get no whipped butter. But I like to uh, uh, have this for my toast. And certain things you just want to... Um, you just want to spread it on there. And then that'll save your butter for when you're cooking, too. I have another little small bag. I don't really like buying a um, small bag, so I just sharp cheddar. Be needing that for your salads and just whatever you want to sprinkle that on. And um, I actually have Mexican cheese, so we don't need to use. I'm about to let my daughter know, use that Mexican cheese when we have tacos. I need to actually move these bags out the way. As you all can see, yeah, we're going to need that later on, that sour cream. Going to get this stuff in this refrigerator. I've been trying to get some content done. I always try to, you know, get some content. And I'm going to get some content outside the house, too. I usually buy two of these. Yeah, at a time, I had a whole lot of these left. Sometimes I eat eggs more often than others. But I always try to keep eggs because not only are they good for eating, but you have to cook a lot with it. If like I made a meatloaf the other day, I didn't post it um on there. I gotta uh, I'm gonna put it on my community tab. Y'all start checking out my community tab too. I be putting stuff on there, so and it'll give you uh, a heads up of about the video and about my day or what I've been going through. So you want to pay attention to that community tab because I might make announcements in there that I otherwise may not do on um a video. And then I got to get used to doing that live. I'm going to start going live, too. Uh, maybe the next time I do a haul, I have this set up. And um, y'all just watch me move and watch me work. That'll probably be easier for me. <laughs> but I want to videotape it, too. You know, I'm, I want to try to get it in as many forms as I can. And I'm, I'm beat up my cheese. Extra sharp cheddar cheese. We like to have those with our grapes and grapes and cheese. We still got some club crackers on there from before up there in the cabinet. There's some club crackers. As a matter of fact, I don't even think I want no bread when I eat this chicken salad a little later. Um, I'm going to want, um, I'm just going to eat some crackers because I'm going to eat me some tacos later. So I'm trying to keep it light. I'm not trying to do nothing real heavy. All right. This is also part of the Sunday dinner pie. Uh, the, this is this is a great substitute, and a lot of the creators do that. They show you how to uh, to put it in the pan. You know, uh, I barely rarely ever make uh, like pies. I make uh, I make uh, cobblers. Is what I make, and I'm gonna make a peach cobbler somewhere in here. It should be some frozen. Uh, I brought some, a couple of bags of frozen um, fruit. I like to have that for my smoothie. My little uh, ninja um, blender is hiding behind there. That's why I got a, a lot of these fruits and vegetables. So two potty, it has two uh, roll-out pie crusts. Pillsbury, the best. You want to, um, if you're not making it homemade, you want to get a good quality pie crust. Now look at this, y'all. This is strange. I'm going to be doing a video on this mug. Let me take a picture of this too. Uh, let's see. <laughs> let's see. I don't want to turn my camera off. Let's see. I'm going to switch hands or something. Yeah. Look at this. Now, I never had this brand pizza. I think it might be their name brand. I mean, their um, store brand. It's called Market Side Mexican Style Street Corn Flatbread. 
It got cheese in it. It got like the Mexican street corn on top of it. I've heard so much about Mexican street corn. And I am going to record a video of me making some homemade. Um, I need to learn how the basics of how to make it. See, I'm yet trying to expand my recipes and my horizons and my taste buds. But yeah, this is the first time I bought this. I'm trying to think how much did I pay for? I can't remember for uh, remember it right now. I just wanted something different because I always could eat pepperoni and, and four meat and um, a tag and sausage and all that. So I just wanted to get something different. So I'm gonna let y'all know I'm gonna be filming um, a taste uh, a taste reaction video to that Mexican street corn flatbread. This is uh look like two bundles of the collards. So that's gonna be going along. I like to mix my greens. I don't never just get um I really ever just get one kind of green. Now if I get one kind of green, it's gonna be collards. It will be collard. I'm gonna I will tell you. I did not know that my daughter did not like these. I bought, I think it was like only $4 or something. Mint flavor Oreo cream cookies. I am going to make me a, a blizzard. I'm not even sure if they even brought my ice cream, y'all. I'm going to have to look at my list because it don't even seem like it's down here boiling. If it is down here, it's going to be melted. My goodness. Yeah, it seems like I don't. I know I ordered some. Yeah, but I don't seem like I see no uh ice cream down here. And see, I wanted the ice cream to go with my uh the ice cream is gonna be with for my uh cobbler. So I can have pie a la mode. My daughter, she likes her four meat pizza, which I like that too. This has sausage beef, pepperoni. And Canadian bacon, and I like uh, they got the bold and zesty sauce on it. It's they got a quarter of a pound of cheese on here, so it's extra cheesy, too. Um, yep, so I got her this two stone pizza. Here go my frozen fruit. Buy you some frozen fruit, boy. Let's go a long way, and it'd be super cheap. This uh, pound of fruit be a dollar. You buy the same stuff, not a dollar, but two dollars and some change. Now you buy that fresh, that's gonna be it's crazy. It might be a a, a dollar or two or a dollar or two more just because you bought it fresh. That is crazy. But this is for my smoothies. That's for my smoothies. This is for my peach cobbler right here. They just make things a lot easier. And I'm gonna just put this in the pan and add my uh my seasonings, my cinnamon, my allspice, and all of that. Good stuff. My corn starts to thicken it up. Y'all see what I'm going to do? Because I'm going to go live when I cook Sunday. Yep. I don't see my ice cream down here. I don't know what happened. I bet you they, I bet you they, I bet you they said it wasn't available. And I think I got one more bag. Let me get up and then I got to put this stuff up, y'all. Yep. I think that's about the only thing that didn't come was the ice cream. All this stuff should have been half off. I had to wait two days, y'all. Two days.